joined here by the victorious Chris Fishgold. You fought UFC, you fought the highest level of mixed martial arts. How much of a buzz was bare boxing? Well, I, I enjoyed this a lot more, you know, even in, um, in the MMA fights, I, I lo everyone that knows me knows I love to strike him, um, love to strike in the gym, I love to strike every place I can, but in the MMA, you've always got that in your head that this guy might take me down if I hit him. Yeah. Here, you haven't got that. So, <laughs> I've seen him cover up and I thought, he might shoot for a double leg now and then I realised, no, he can't, do you know what I mean? <laughs> but no way, I think now that I've seen what it's like, I think I can go away, know what I need to work on, and that is, that is when people are covering up. Because obviously it's a lot different when you've got bare hands. I hit him on the couple top of the head a few times and I feel it now, do you know what I mean? But I'm ready to go again. If he's had a fight next week, I jump in next week. Um, I just want to fight every show I can now. You absolutely bum rushed him, you know, you came out the gates fast, no hesitation at all. Yeah, yeah. Was that the game plan coming into overwhelm? Nah, I never had the I never had the clue. <laughs> nah, honestly I, I didn't know what I was gonna expect. I think I was gonna see if he was gonna run at me, because he looks a quite intimidating person. And when he never thought, fucking oh, that's me that <laughs> don't want me and so but no I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Made up, made up. Thank you very much. So I'm going to assume you're going to fight Ben Knuckle again. This isn't just a one-off. Oh, no, 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 no. This is for the seeable future. I still want to do me MMA. But if I maybe do two MMA a year. Yeah. I try and get five Ben Knuckle in and that'll stop me getting in trouble. Do you know, after me fights as well? Do you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, I think, yeah. I'm 29 now. I've been doing this since I was 17. I think it's now like the first 10 years of my career. It was just enjoying myself and now. Now it's to set up a family show for by the time I'm 40, 45, so 15 years in the making now, this is when I start taking it serious now, so hopefully you'll see the best me in there and the best me in the cage in the future, and plus this is only going to help me cage anyway, you know, I'm a black belt in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, so if I can strike and fucking get in there with them, I'm, yo, I'll be aware, I'll, I'll be happy with that. And finally, anyone to thank? Yeah, me, me corner, uh, Ali and um, Coach Winto that come down, um, really helped me out a lot. Uh, my little brother Michael, my mum, uh, my dad, everyone at Aspire, you know, everyone's helped me so much. Uh, me, me, me sponsors, Macro Chef, uh, Macro Chef and Scramble, and there will be another one if you check out my Instagram, I just can't remember it yet. Yeah. But yeah, thank you, and you used to give me the opportunity, thank you very much. Yeah. Chris Fishgold, absolute legend. Thank you very much, mate, appreciate that.